A SPORE grant is a specialized program of research excellence that's funded by the National Cancer Institute to fund translational research in cancer. And translational research means research that has direct benefit to the patient, that can translate directly. We'll be studying a cancer that's called multiple myeloma. This cancer is a cancer of the bone marrow that affects about 1% of Americans, or about 25,000 people every year in this country. And this will mean that we can uh, develop better cures more quickly with the funds that we'll receive. So the research that we're gonna do is groundbreaking research with viral therapy, which is a virus which is alive and can divide and replicate inside a cancer cell, causing it to die. And then we'll also use novel immune therapies where we take the body's own immune system and make it realize that the cancer is there and is foreign and cause the immune system to reject and get rid of it. We're also going to look at a very novel uh, mechanism of cancer progression using an oncogene, a cancer-causing gene that we've known about for decades called MYC. And finally, we're going to study the extreme complexity of all the different tumor cells, which we now know are not all the same, but each can have very unique differences, and that causes a big problem with drug resistance. So it's very important that the research we do uh, affects and, and makes a difference in the lives of patients within five years. That's one of the criteria in order to be awarded one of these uh, grants. And so we've designed and, uh, experiments which we know we will treat patients with live virus or we'll treat them with drugs that enhance the immune system um, and do things that will have an impact in a meaningful time frame. And I can say that over the past five or ten years, we've made dramatic improvements in the treatment of patients with multiple myeloma, more than doubling the survival. And we can expect to continue that rapid progress. Well, so multiple myeloma is uh, not an uncommon disease. It, uh, Patients are living longer with it, and I think patients may be more uh, commonly talking about their disease. And so it's, it's worth noting that uh, Tom Brokaw uh, has come forward and said publicly that he has multiple myeloma, and he's written a book on that. And he's also been a longtime supporter of the Mayo Clinic and uh, served on the Board of Governors. And he's agreed to be an advocate for all patients with multiple myeloma and as a representative on our SPORE will bring their viewpoint to us so that we can really make a difference for patients. And at the same time, he'll advocate to the wider community about the importance of supporting fundamental research of cancer. I do see a cure for this disease over the next couple of decades, and I think it's possible that we're even curing a fraction of the patients now. The problem is that it takes such a long time to know that we've cured them, but it, without a doubt, some patients are living long periods of time with disease that is either uh, undetectable or quiescent and easily managed with the drugs that we have available.